This is Nick and Eric, and at this moment, they are on their way to Austin to play on a live stream at The Lodge. The Lodge is owned by three of the biggest poker players in the world, Doug Polk, Andrew Nemi, and Brad Owen. We got news that Brad Owen is going to be playing on the stream as well. Once Nick and Eric heard this, they zoomed as fast as they- Oh my god! Holy shit! What the absolute fu- <laughs> I'm just kidding. They made it there perfectly fine. Nick and Eric are both going to be playing, but on different days. Eric will play on the first day, and Nick on the second, and Brad Owen will be playing with Nick. Let's get straight into some hands with Eric. And from the Dallas area, seat seven well, on tilt. Really fast. So as you can see, Eric buys in for $2,000. Nothing really happens for about an hour, until Eric wakes up with pocket fives. They're playing the knit game, and only Eric and one other guy still have their button. Crypto Max has pocket nines and three bets Eric to $500. On tilt, looking to play some defense with pocket fives, and he's going to make the call. Eric has the knit button still, and is a huge fucking donkey, so he makes the call. Pierre with King Queen is also going to make the call and come along for the ride. Three ways to this flop. Flop comes an absolute shitter with two aces and a ten. That's an action killer right there. Pierre now with the gut shot to Broadway. Hold on. But it's on tilt. Oh, I thought this was oh, that life a lot easier. Yeah. Check. You know the difference between block block. Wow. On tilt went all in. <laughs> and it was Max's turn. Out of turn, all in bed. So Max now checks. So Eric is either a dumbass for going all in out of turn, or truly a fucking genius. Pierre is going to fold. Now it's just Eric and Crypto Max heads up. This is bad news for Eric if Max calls. He has a huge lead. Crypto Max is so far out in front. Hey, I just said that, jackass. Not a great flop for pocket nines. But two aces on the board means it's less likely somebody has an ace. Yes, but Eric is doing great at representing an ace but on tell, telling the story that he's got it. Are you just gonna keep copying what I fucking say or what, buddy? He's looking like he might actually fold. He goes in the tank for about a minute or two. And boom! He lays it down on tilt. He's gonna show it, he's got the knit button. Oh, I'll go, go ahead. Nice play by On Tilt. Indeed it was. Good job, Eric. $3,600 going his way. Hey, what's up, Peter? Sorry, I'm late. Oh, hey, what's up, Cartman? No worries, buddy. Uh, do you want to take this one? Yes, please. I would love to. Looks like Eric has king-queen suited and is going to raise it to 75. There's three colors and, oh, shit. Ted has ace-king suited. He's going to raise it to $500. Oh, my God. Check out the balls on this kid. Eric's going to make the call. Everybody else folds, so Eric's going heads up to the flop, and it comes absolute horseshit for him, but Eric does have a backdoor spade draw. On tilt with backdoor spades? Yeah, I just fucking said that. Tell me about it. This guy likes to repeat what we say. Shut up, fat ass. I don't need your help. Hey, you're fat too, buddy. Anyways, Ted is going to bet 275. Eric snap calls with only 7 fucking percent. Holy shit, a spade comes on the turn. Now only a spade can save him. Ted taps his arm and checks it over to Eric. Let's see what he does here with the nut spade draw. But Eric says fuck that and bets 550. Holy shit! Ted raises Eric and forces him to either go all in or fold. Eric goes into the tank. Is he really thinking about calling here? Oh my god, and he does! Ted says he wants to run it once. Come on, spade! On tilt looking for a spade. It gets there! Holy shit, what a luck box! On tilt was reaching for more chips and gets there for $6,030. All right, thank you, Cartman. I'll take it back over from here. Sure thing, buddy. Thanks for having me. Eric has King Jack off on this one. Uh-oh, Jay win has pocket queens. There was a raise to 75 and two callers. Now the action is on Eric. He decides to three bet it to 400. Jay win is gonna grab some raising chips and raise it to $1,200. Ted is going to fold, so Eric and Jay win are heads up. Eric makes the call. Wow, what a fucking wizard. Jesus Christ, what a flop for Eric. Top two pair. Wow. You, wow. Eric's going to check it over to Jay Wynn. Jay Wynn also checks. It, it, There's wow. the queen. Money card for Jay Wynn. Oh, fuck. Of course the queen just had to come. Eric checks again, and Jay Wynn shoves. Oh, this is not good for Eric at all. A quick call here. Oh. I was thinking about it. Uh, I just so dead on the flop. I don't think I can get away from this one. 
Yes, you can. Just fold the cards, buddy. Until dead to the king of hearts. Makes the and call. Then, there's the call. Ah, damn it. Yeah. Yeah. Biggest <laughs> part of the day. Whatever, I don't care. Go around twice. Oh, wow. You see, on tilt, dead to the king of hearts. Eric only with one out. I hope a king comes. Nice. I had a king. They're going to run it twice. <laughs> oh, oh, my goodness. Oh. Boat for no. yeah. both Jay Wynn. Boat over boat. Yeah, boat over boat. No, dude, I'm not needing anything. No, you're good, dude. Oh, wow, wow, how goodness. fucking sick. I swear I didn't mean it. Well, all the money was going to get in on the river there if they hadn't gotten it in on the turn. No, you're good. And that'll do it for On Tilt. It was making a good comeback, and then Jay win. All right, boys, I'm done. Nice playing with y'all. That was a good one. Yeah. No, you're good, bro. And that's the end of the stream for Eric. I'm sorry, buddy. All right, all right, enough of the sad shit. Let's see how Nick did the very next day. He's got Jack 10 suited on this one and raises to 65. Cinnabon with 8 9 suited, three bets to $300. Both Mo Money and Nick make the call. Nick flops top pair, but Cinnabon has an open ended straight draw. Nick and Mo Money both check, but Cinnabon decides to bet $200. Uh, Mo Money folds and Nick makes the call. The turn comes a great card for Nick. Brick for Cinnabon, and now upgrades Nick to a flush draw. Looks like Nick is going to check. Oh my god, Cinnabon goes all in. And Nick with top pair and a flush draw snap calls. Oh, you have a jack? Yeah, you got him. Cinnabon's out. Whatever you want to do. I was like, the other guy shoes all the time. Uh, we can go twice this one. Whatever you decide, it's fine. Oh, you got hearts too? Holy shit. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Why is that scoop? He's 6-6. Six, six. I believe they're going to run it twice. Sophia's going to give us the first one. Nick takes the first one. Cinnabon needs some help here. Good. It's not come. Scoop for on tilt. Thank you, game wife. $4,200 going Nick's way. After that, Nick is up about $3,800. Hey, Peter, please move your fat ass out of the way. I'll take it from here. Why is everybody so mean to me? I'm sorry, buddy. You're just severely overweight. Anyways, Nick wakes up with ace queen off. T1000 looks down at pocket sevens, and he's going to raise it to 150. Travis with pocket eights is going to make the call. Eights, this could be spicy here. Damn right, like a little fucking pepper. Nick drops his nuts and raises it to $910. Both T1000 and Travis make the call. The flop comes fucking beautiful for Nick. Top pair, I mean, what more could you ask for? An interesting bet of 1,020. That is a weird bet. T1000 folds. Little daddy Good Travis. Have the best hand. Hmm. Probably. Travis also makes the fold. JC had me set up with him for them queens, boy. God almighty. $3,800 for the Super Pro. Good hand, baby. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You don't lose your knit button, though. Oh, Ooh, no. Oh, that's Max no, Payne. No, no. Wow, Nick, what a dumbass. Smart and big and no. good about I, No, I felt really big. Yeah, I felt really big. Show, I wanted so. to show that one, too. You have that. to show both yeah. cards to the release your knit button back to the dealer. <laughs> Nick gets pocket sixes and three bets, the initial raise to 300. T1000, four bets to 1000 with ace jack off. Everybody else folds, but Nick makes the call. Flop comes pretty decent for Nick giving him two pair. T1000 is going to lead with a bet of $400. And of course, Nick's going to snap call him. Ah, oh, fuck, the turn comes an ace. T1000 bets 600 this time. I don't think Nick is buying it, so he calls once again. Nick is pretty much dead at this point. Can the river save him? Fuck no, it can't. Nick is absolutely fucked. T1000 makes a bet of 1500 and Nick's dumbass calls again. Ace, 1500. Nice, Ambo. Nice. Gonna fire out 1500 wow. and on tilt makes the call. Quick call. Uh oh. Rough. End, end the stream. End it. Wrap it up. <laughs> <laughs> nice one for T1000. So the stream ends a couple hands after that. And as you can see, Nick finishes the session up about $4,600. Good job, Donkey Fuck. I'm real proud of you. After the stream, Nick and Eric get a call from Bretzky. He tells them that he's going to be in Vegas for Super Bowl weekend and that they should come out. Well, what do you think the two donkeys said? They said, fuck yeah! 
So Vegas and football, here we come, baby. Stay tuned because it's gonna be wild. Oh, and subscribe, please. We're broke.